Uh, state your name and your occupation. Maria Sainz, third grade reading teacher at Idea Mission. And the topic of this project is homelessness in the valley. What do you know about this topic? What do I know about homelessness? In the valley, yes. Um, I know over the years there's been an increase in people who are homeless in the valley. Um, maybe I noticed it now that I'm older, but it is pretty noticeable, especially around the farm McAllen area. What do you feel politicians can do to help alleviate the problem? Um, I think politicians should make it, um, should be aware of the problem and let the public know that this is an issue and find some means like a shelter or possible, you know, small occupations that could help the homeless in their situation. How big or pressing do you feel this topic is today? I don't think it's very pressing because there are bigger matters here in the Valley and uh, sadly people are very selfish. So it doesn't seem as pressing. Um, but I think people should be aware and try to help them out, especially during, you know, our hot summers and our, you know, our, our cold winters. Um, I think that's when people should be the most aware of homelessness here in the Valley. Say your name and occupation. Nancy Veronica Nerio, I am a kindergarten teacher. The topic for this project is homelessness in the valley. What do you know about in the this, valley? In the valley. What do you know about this topic? Um, I feel like there has been an increase in um the population of the homelessness and of the population of the uh, how do I say it? Um I feel like there's been an increase in the number of homeless people in the valley, which can I I feel like you see that with the number of people who you see on the corners, like begging and stuff. What do you feel politicians can do to help alleviate the problem? Um, I feel like they should be able to start a program, um, uh, focusing on like mental health because a lot of the people who are homeless tend to be uh tend to have some sort of uh condition whether it be mental or physical and they have no assistance so maybe kind of like reaching out to them and giving them either like job opportunities or some sort of therapy to help better themselves how big slash pressing do you feel this topic is today It, um, like on a scale of 1 to 10? Yes. I think it's like at a 7, but it should be more. Just because I know a lot of the, a lot of the people who are becoming homeless are, like, again, people with mental health conditions or physical, or like, physically handicapped, um, Especially in the, especially like with veteran, military veterans. They come back and they just don't get the treatment and they lose their homes, lose their jobs. 